Hey, and welcome back to my channel. Make sure you click that subscribe button and that notification bell so you can always receive alerts when I upload new videos and live streams and give me a thumbs up at the end of the video. Hey, so I'm back with another plan with me in my mini happy planner. And if y'all have been following me, um, this month will be the last month that I will be doing a plan with me in my mini happy planner. Yes, sad but not sad. I am going to a traveler's notebook, but the good news is the layout of my traveler's notebook will be fairly similar to um, how a mini planner would be set up. Um, so you will still get some of the same style um, layouts um, that will not only inspire you for your mini planner, but it will also inspire you if you have a traveler's notebook. So before we get into our first spread in the full week of December, just to kind of show you an after the pin from last week, which was November the 26th through December the 2nd. I got a lot of stuff done. As y'all know, I do a lot of deco, but it's always enough functional white space for me to be able to um, jot things down that's been pre-planned or things that come as the days go so we're going to go ahead and get started for monday the third through sunday the ninth i already have a post-it note here just for one thing that came up that i wasn't able to put in my um monthly command center which is my monthly view um, but i have my sticky note and i'm going to make sure that i put it here after the pen but as you all know my videos are always before the pen so if you want to see how i set up the first week and my last first week in my mini happy planner stick around
Okay, you guys, so I am finished my spread in my mini happy planner for the week of December the 3rd through the 9th. And I am really, really happy with this spread. It is simply beautiful, no pun intended. And it was my Simply Gilded Washi that I got out of um, last month's subscription box that kind of set the tone for where I was gonna go with the spread. The colors in here are pink, rose gold, um, almost like a cream color. Um, so I decided to um, use the floor washi to cover up this part. This is what the side with the punch looks like. So I'm gonna go ahead and punch this as well before I put it in my planner. But I decided to use the thinner washi this time instead of the thick one, um, just because I didn't want it touching um, the sides and kind of clashing. But I'm really, really happy with how this turns out. I mean, who said that you can't have a fully decorated spread that still allows you to have a lot of function with plenty of white space? I mean, I not only have places to write on my stickers that I place, but I still have white space that was originally there from the actual um, pages itself. So this is it. This is my first and my last first week of December spread in my mini happy planner. Like I said, I'm going to do my um, planning in my TN. My TN is going to be my lifestyle planner, which will house everything pertaining to my life. So until then, we still have three more weeks of planning in my mini three more weeks of just continue to create and inspire and hopefully you guys will love the new direction that i'm going but i'm going to still have the same type of style and technique that i've always had so if you like this video make sure you give me a thumbs up drop me a comment below if you have any questions or you just want to leave some words of encouragement as well, if you haven't already done so, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Click that notification bell so you never miss a new video or a live stream. And as well, check out all the links and the different um, codes for stickers and things that are listed in the description box. There's a lot of good information in that box for you, so make sure you don't skip over that part. But again, if you like this spread, make sure you share this with your planner friends so they can be inspired to create their own lovely plan. So until next time, planner fam, peace.